The BBC's been a member of World DMB since the beginning. We were part of the companies who decided that it was a good idea to have an organisation which went across the industry and uh, looked at all aspects of digital radio. And so we've been a very active member since the beginning, and what we find is that it gives us very good intelligence on what everybody else in the world is doing, um, and it allows us to put forward our point of view uh, in a forum where people are listening. I think for the international rollout of uh, DAB radio, um, it's really enabled by World DMB bringing together all the different entities um, from different countries, talking about different ideas, giving people in uh, different countries the opportunity to network with people who've been there before, who've done it before. I think it's really important for broadcasters like we are in Belgium to be part of the World DMB platform because for us is the, the big opportunity of learning how the, how the things are moving every, everywhere in the world. This is really uh, the first uh, a thing that means exchanges of information. Then second point, I think it's a kind of lobby platform. So it's uh, the possibility to put pressure on the public authorities to, to understand what are the problems between the members. That means the different segments, uh, the radio industry, the broadcasters and the manufacturers. World DMB helps us uh, through um, sharing of experiences. There are so many companies with different backgrounds there. Um, there are competitors, of course, but there are also a lot of people who we can benefit from. You have the entire value chain represented, um, and we, we do learn a lot uh, when it comes to sharing experiences and such. It's very useful. Uh, lots of um, very skilled people um, are, of course, also members, and, and we get to meet them. We can call them. You always have someone to, to, to talk to if you have any questions.